been telling you about the eclipse for quite some time. It's going to be exciting. But before science, many cultures had their own theories about what caused the phenomenon. Those myths have been passed down and led to modern day superstitions. Annie Ellie Ruiz has the story. A total solar eclipse, a beautiful astronomical phenomenon that can now be explained with science. But before that, well, there were some interesting theories dating back to ancient times. Here's David Cook, a religious professor at Rice University. As humans, we seek for some sort of meaning. While some cultures believe the eclipse happened when dragons attacked the moon, the Aztecs believe the jaguar would eat the sun. Those stories help explain the meaning behind many cultural traditions. Obviously, the sun is absolutely central to human existence. And so the covering of the sun ever since time immemorial has been something that that's an event that people have commemorated. And that leads us to superstitions that medical professor Dr. Joseph Varon with the University of Houston says have been passed on for generations. Uh, Persian uh, people believe that if a woman who's pregnant touches her face during an eclipse, the baby will come out with a birthmark. And it's not just the Persians. Dr. Varon says his Hispanic patients, well, they've come up to him asking him about their pregnant superstitions, like wearing red underwear or safety pins while pregnant. Remember that Aztec beliefs? Well, this idea evolved into the Mexican warning for pregnant women who looked at the eclipse. The baby may come uh, out without a piece of their face, you know, like a cliff palette or, or stuff like that. And Dr. Varon says he explains science to his patients. First, you know, I tell them that there is no data whatsoever that... But he knows that ultimately... You have to be respectful of their uh, beliefs. I tell them what science says. He says his patients will still do what brings them peace of mind. Hundreds of years of tradition that a single healthcare provider is not going to change, no matter what I tell them. Anayeli Ruiz, KHOU 11 News.